Playing through the line, not trying to slog, beautifully played. The offside as well as when it's shot. Down the leg side, and then that's what Sanaka gets a silly good job. Get your drugs in there. Good catch up by us in the fan. Get rid of Ravindu. Then come Lairu Matsanka. Four. And this massive six. Those wickets kept falling except for Osh and the Fernando. Nobody really got going in this team in this uh, chase. Asela Gururatna had a bit of a start while that partnership between Ashida and Osh and Asela did seem a little threatening at certain points, but once that wicket of Osh and the Fernando fell, they never really got going. And eventually, it was a writing on the wall for the Reds. 20 extras in their innings. Grace once again putting in a very good performance even with the ball. Nuan Pradeep leading from the front, two wickets, 17 runs given away. On the spinners, Pulna Taranga, Asha and Daniel, all of them among the wickets. Also contributed by Chaturanga de Silva, Mati Chapatri and the slinger. And in the end it was Lahiru Madhushang who bowled one over and picked up a wicket himself. Arishka Fernando and Chandimal open the batting for the Reds. They've been in very good form in their previous games. They did look threatening. They played a couple of very good looking shots and it seemed like we have a chase on. But this happened. And a superb catch, a running catch by Pulna Taranga. A brilliant effort in the field, almost sparked the collapse for the Reds. Those kind of moments in the field is what can change games completely. Suddenly the Greys were up and running. There was a moment of energy among them. There was a vibe about them. And since then, there were a few shots few and far in between. This is once again another brilliantly judged catch there. Spulna Taranga again. It was all over the place today. The ball kept finding him and he kept catching it to perfection. This was another beautiful catch again by Kamil Mishara. So very good on the field, Grace. Their bowlers bowling the right lines and lengths. Fielding and fielders assisting them. There were a few boundaries hit by Oshita Fernando and Asile Ratna. They, they did look like they might just take this away. Oshita Fernando looked really good. Generally, you find him a bit uncomfortable in the T20 format, but today he looked like he came out with a purpose. Catch, 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 catch. In the end, it was one shot too many that led to the perish of Oshita the Fernando. The fan himself, Pulle Taranga, what a day he's had, what a night he's had. fast and ensuring that he took those bails off. Youngster Nipun Dalanjia. I guess too short of experience for him to be able to put out and to complete a chase like this. Hasan Kudrapto also getting out with that delivery from Dasun Chanaka. Santosh Kuta Tilaka. He came on and tried a little bit. But eventually he too had to perish. Formality. 